You're not as dumb as you look. Like that. I see. Yeah. Oh. Thank you. Right? Yeah, that's <laughs> that's yeah, like, yeah, yeah, you just just can't do that. Like, she's straight, straight up holding that in. She fucking hates you. She hates you. Welcome back to our show where we get real with our thoughts on all things concerning life. We're your hosts, Ashley, Juni, and Peniel of B2B. Before we get into this, make sure to follow and review our podcast on Spotify and Apple. Did you guys know Google Podcasts no longer exists? What? Yeah. No more Google well, Podcasts. That's what I heard too. Damn. Yeah. But so if just, it does, five stars and everything. Five stars and everything. Yeah. But yeah, it doesn't exist anymore, right? All right. Well, today we'll be discussing how to start relationships and strengthen bonds. Mm. We have a special guest joining us today in the studio. So everyone, please give a warm welcome to Isaac Hall. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh, we didn't even introduce ourselves, do we? Oh, we, we did. did. Okay. What yeah, the we did. Well, hello, welcome. Hello. Hi. Hi. I'm Isaac. Nice to see you guys. Nice to see you guys. Nice to see you. Your voice I'm is nice so quiet. See. Yeah. Oh, it should get a little louder, huh? Yes. Mm, please. Ah, yeah. Wait, Isaac, do you want to introduce yourself? Oh yes. Uh, I'm Isaac. I'm a singer songwriter in Korea. Uh, yeah. Whoa. I think that's it. What? What? I thought what? you were way younger. Really? Yeah. He looks young. Yeah. I Thank thought you, you were like around my age. How old are you? Ninety-three. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. I'm. Yeah. I'm older than it looks. Than my. Yeah. Mm. Wait. Yeah, uh, Go ahead. Where are you from? I'm from Korea. I was born in Korea. Oh. Lived in Korea for like 30 years. Wait, how do you speak so such good English? I, I actually I lived in Papua New Guinea when I was in third grade. Oh, like, what? what? About three and a half years. Three and a half years and then that's it. Yeah, that's it. And then your English is like top tier. I mean, yeah, but my grammar is and stuff, it's like very elementary. Dude, you sound like you're like you live in the States. Yeah, I can pretend like I the stage, but not. That's all Whoa. fake. <laughs> it's Whoa. all fake. It's all fake. That's, that's I, can pretend, start. I can pretend, but like I mean, the age is really important. I think. Right. Like, no, but but then you you went to Berkeley. Yeah. So how long was that? That was, that was for about a year. Oh, a year. Oh. I didn't have enough money, so I just came back. Yeah. Oh, I just came back. <laughs> Tuition. <Yeah, yeah>, yeah. <laughs> Come back. So yeah, Tuitions are so expensive. Wait, what was? Aren't it? you Berkeley too? No. Thank you for thinking that. <laughs> I would love to go to Berkeley. I thought you said you were no, Berkeley. No, no. I'm all streets, man. Wait, who is yeah, I'm all streets. Berkeley? A lot, a lot of people. There's a bunch of people. A lot of people are from Berkeley. Yeah. yeah. But since you you went there for one year, probably… Do you have… Like, do you know anyone that went… Well, I, I only have a few friends there. Yeah. Um, But not that… Who's actually… You know… In the industry? Yeah, in the industry. Mm. Mm. You know, okay. Not many people are there, so… Wait, can you tell us a little about your uh, life in Papua New Guinea? What is like? What is it like? Um, I mean, it's been about what, like, it's been too long. Like twenty three years, <laughs> but I was there for when I was in elementary school. Mm -hmm. Um, it was for it's. It was a. I went there because my parents went there. Oh. Um, they were missionaries, oh. so oh, cool, cool. yeah, and I got to um study in American school. So that's wow. how I got my English there. But it was very international. Wow. So our class had like 24 kids and… That's it? Yeah, that's it. And But we had all students from 16 countries. Wow. So yeah, that yeah. makes it sound even smaller. 16 <laughs> countries. Yeah, so that must have been a crazy switch in your life. Yeah, it was. I mean, actually the switch… The really hard part came when I came back to Korea. Really? Wow. Yeah, when I was in seventh grade. Wow. Because usually, you know, uh, puberty kind of hit early there. So it was <sighs> it was a time when I got all the cultural things and the language and the, mm. everything's there. And then I came back to Korea. Right. That was like seventh grade. And that was… Chungir. Chungir, yeah. So you come back in Chungir, it's a different yeah, world. Yeah, that was here. a totally different world. Wow. I had to wear cute uniforms and uh, we had like hair restrictions. No way. So like yeah. everything was there. So it was really difficult to come <laughs> But you got to remember his age. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> yeah, yeah, remember Stop. there's hair restrictions <laughs> and uh, yeah, we had that Wait, you back in the day. Hair, but hair restrictions? Oh, <laughs> uh, I didn't go to school oh, here. Oh, you didn't go to school yeah, here. So I you didn't go know. to school here. I did for a year. 
When? When? Was that? 2010. But that was in university. Oh, university? university? I went to university doesn't too. have restrictions. No, no, no I went to like, like, high school. Oh, yeah. Did they have restrictions? No. Probably because you went to… Did university you go to an school. art school? No, I went to… The, I went to Cheongdam. Oh. School. We know nothing about each other, huh? <laughs> Yeah. Why are we doing the show together? <laughs> that to find out. Yeah, to and find you know, out. strengthen bonds. Right. That's mm-hmm. what we're doing today. I went to Cheongdam today. for like one year but… Got it. Wait, I already told you guys this story. I love you bro. Oh yeah, yeah. I remember. They just like… They just, <laughs> like, no they just let me off the hook yeah. of, for everything because I was from America. Oh yeah. Mm. He's only three years older than me so stop trying to make him sound like he's… Yeah, she was kind of rattled by that old. too. I mean you old too. Oh f- You I old too. Yeah, I know. I Anyways. didn't say I was young. <laughs> I'm just saying. What about, what about the, old now? What about the uh, your name, Isaac? Like, did you did your parents choose it for you, or yeah, did you was, get to choose? my my parents. I mean, they're your Korean. Parents. Parents. I know, but then ah, he was at a certain age where he, he'll be able to choose. You know what I mean? Because I wasn't name? able to choose my own. His name. Korean name is Isak. Your Korean name is Isak yeah, too. My name yeah. Is, yeah. Oh, it really so, says it right here. Hong Isak. So that's you why he's read. Isaac. No, I, <laughs> yeah. Bro? Yeah, no, I thought you just… This is your artist <laughs> name too. So just, yeah, that's, no, that's my, that's my artist oh, I got you, got you. That's amazing, amazing. Name. Amazing. Yeah. Artist name is Isaac Nim. Right. <laughs> 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 All right. Your MBTI is ENTP. Mm-hmm. Um, very similar to Peniel. Peniel's oh, ESTP. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So just one apart. Yeah. Uh, he's gotten a lot of awards. Like in 2013, he got the Tongsang at Yujea Umak Gyeongyeon Dehe, which is a huge deal. Yeah. He won Sing Again 3. <laughs> wow. He got the Indie Icon Award at the Universal Superstar Award. Damn, this is all this year. Yeah. yeah it happened after all Sing Again, so. Crazy. It okay. happened in between, so I was like, okay. <laughs> and you got the uh, Ore brand design. Yeah. That's yeah. Mm. I think it's just a thankful thing, you know, after yeah. winning the audition, all those things happen. Because you were great, man. Yeah, Thank I heard you. Sing yeah. Again was so tough because my member Ho Jong was on the first or second Sing Again. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And she said it was really tough. Mm. Um. Yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a tough thing, tough gig. <laughs> tough <laughs> you have gig. to, like, yeah, prepare everything by yourself, basically. Yeah, choosing the song and arranging the song and preparing all this like backing tracks and you know, everything. So congrats! Awesome. Yeah. You had to prepare the, even the backing tracks yourself too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. So that's what happened the whole time. Must have must have been a lot of work. Awesome. Well, you you did it, man. Yeah, I mean, it paid off. Yeah, it paid off. Look yeah. at you! All these awards. Yeah, yeah. I'm here yeah. meeting you guys, so it's all it's all paid off yeah. now. Yay. Yeah, I think because you're that was here. His final goal. Uh, we got sponsored. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> yeah, that paid off. Yeah. <laughs> yes. got a sponsor. Yeah. Ooh. Can we talk about the sponsorship, Ashley? <laughs> yes, we have a sponsor for this episode, Lotte Well Food and Pepero. Bam! <laughs> Pepero, baby. We're going to be talking about Pepero Day, which is November 11th every year later mm. in the episode. So be sure to stick around. You guys all know Pepero, right? Yeah. Of course. Pepero. Of course. Number one. I mean, our viewers might not. If they're um, from think, overseas. No, I think in so, international you can still get pepper too there too, no? Yeah. It's like yeah. stick snacks. Come on. Usually with chocolate covered <laughs> chocolate covered stick snacks. Yeah. Uh-huh, but they have a variety of flavors. As you can mm-hmm. see. Yeah. What's this one? The almond? Yeah. Oh, the almond, almond one is so good. The original cookies and cream. Oh, and there's I love the white. It's white, white cookie, cookies bro. and cream. I would always um, get the original pepero and uh-huh. like suck all the chocolate off and then eat the. That's crack. disgusting. I, yeah, I hate I'm people joking. that do yeah, that. It's good. No, Why? that is nasty. Yeah. Why? Because by the time all the chocolate's gone, the cracker part is like all cold. soggy too. But yeah. inside, it's still crispy. Is it? How do you eat it? Just like a normal person? Yeah, yeah. like a normal Ew. person. You said, so it, you said it the Ew. best. Just That's like a normal so person. Like a normal person. How do you eat it? What the. I just eat it. You never like scratched it off with your teeth? I've done like, it before. Like the chocolate part? You've done <laughs> I've before. done it before. Right? Yeah. You know what I'm saying, yeah, right? Yeah, but not just the tip. <laughs> no. I go all the way, baby. <laughs> Let's go to our topic now. Yeah. Um, Since I've met Isaac before <laughs> on radio. Mm-hmm. But it's Peniel and Junie's first time mm-hmm. meeting Isaac. So… Mm-hmm. No. No? You met him? Yeah, like 20 minutes ago. Oh god. <laughs> okay. Anyways. Uh, um, no, but he looks familiar. Yeah? Because you've probably maybe seen him so much on TV, yeah, bro. Yeah, maybe you watch like a but snippet of Sing Again. Or on your Instagram. Maybe. 
That's why when I saw him, I was like, have we met? I was like, I, I don't I think so. I met other members of you. Like, oh. from other members. Like, Honestly, you look like a kyoe oppa uh-huh. at every church. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a good thing? It's a good thing, right? Like, I don't know. Like like a lot of Kyoeopa have this image, you know mm-hmm. what I mean? Like like the glasses, like calm curly hair, mm-hmm. like very demure, you know, very calm. Very demure, <laughs> very demure. Very demure. demure. <laughs> like you know what I mean? Like I'm trying to figure uh, out if this is a compliment or. <laughs> I'm sure it is. <laughs> it's a compliment. A Was this it's your like, look your whole like throughout your whole life, even at Berkeley too? I mean, yeah. I mean, Berkeley was similar. Yeah. Um, you never I had, had like a… I like had a, time when my hair got like… Oh. Uh, it was really long. Like rock oh. star. Like, uh, yeah. To my, to my shoulders or something. I see that. Yeah, like, yeah I see that. You have yeah. a picture? Yeah, I have a picture. <laughs> have a picture. But, <laughs> but that day is kind of left now, so… Oh. <laughs> You're kind of like… Sangyeon le puri pesu sang. Yeah, I yeah, heard that like, too. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Basically he… Great image for the parents. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. yeah. What about Pinio? Do you think he's a great image for the parents right now? Dude, parents love me. Oh, I… <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Especially the pink, huh? Yeah, man. Yeah. I love that shade of pink. He looks good in pink. Mm. Thank yeah. you. Alright. Wait, so Isaac, what, what was your first eye? impression of Pinil? Of Pinil? Mm. Yeah. I think I'm gonna remember your eyes. <laughs> yeah, he's got something crazy going on. Yeah, yeah. He's got a style right, right now. Yeah. Mm. Okay. You know, I knew it. because she asked me if I got egg yolk hair pilla. I didn't say that. <laughs> Who it said wasn't it then? me. Oh, someone said it was that. Someone, someone, else. Like, someone, like, someone like, said that and it was yeah, me. I was, like, I, was like, <laughs> I was like, I was like, what the f- are you talking about? I, and I, I looked asked, and I was like, oh. Yeah. I asked if it was a sty. Oh, like no. oh, yeah, you, oh yeah, you. Uh, p- sty is not pink. Oh, eye. I what mean, whatever. Pink uh, sty. Pink eye you get from like sh- getting in your eye. Okay. Oh, it's not the same. No. Oh. The f- pink eye is, is is different from is pink sty. eye. Sty. Yeah. Sty. What's pink eye? It's like when your eyes like pink all eye. pink and then it gets like oh, crusty and shit. And ugh. pink eye is super contagious. Oh. Yeah, you yeah. get that from getting like poo feces like in your eye. Oh, okay. <laughs> Whoa. How, right. do you, how does that work? No, for real. Just go to the doctor, damn it. Yeah, please. Go get We've checked. We've been telling you. It'll go away. It's okay. It'll go away. Yeah, tareki <sighs> goes away. But yeah. There's gonna be… There, hey, there's gonna be something… I made a first impression through my tareki. So. Nice. Yeah, I'll probably good. remember. Ah, oh, yeah. tareki. You know, like whenever. Yeah. <laughs> hey, oh, where did I see you before? It's like the tareki. It's like, oh, sh- <laughs> This is like the pijar, but um, I think people with big eyes get tareki more. Oh, I thought… Okay. I thought it was just Yeah, I thought it was for sanitary reasons. Yeah. No, because I've asked Maybe. people of my friends who don't have big eyes. And okay. they never got it before. Okay, Juni. Sure. Why would you point at him? He's, got, yeah. <laughs> he's never got it? Yeah. He said he gets it all the time. Before? No, no? He's, oh, okay. he always gets it. Oh, he's got Yard it. He always gets it. Oh, he so gets it's it. not true. Never mind. It was Damn. the <laughs> God. It was Nepisher. I said it was Nepisher. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay. Okay. Yeah. Anyways, uh, what was your first impression of Juni, Isaac? Yeah. Juni? Mm. Um, actually, you were carrying a dog. Yes, I was carrying. He's right there. He's over yeah, there. He's why? not. Yeah. You brought your dog? Yeah, My dog's here. here. But I want. I didn't want to take the attention off uh, Isaac because he's our guest. So. No, no. But like having a dog. I mean, it, it's a good impression though. Like. Oh, is know, it? Mm. Do you have a dog yourself? No, I don't have. A dog. Oh, okay. Wait. That's the only reason he got a dog. Just to, to, get to a, make a, a good, good impression. Get impression. girls. Yeah. What? Oh. <laughs> what the hell? Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I guess I, I was a wrong guess. So yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> what was your first impression of him? Exactly the same. Like very calm, demure. Mm-hmm. He had the demure. Because <laughs> we talked about this last episode. Yeah. About what demure was. Mm-hmm. And I was like, what is it? And I met Isaac. I was like, oh. That's what it is. We talked about it last episode. He you wasn't here. here. Oh, okay. Bro, I was like, but… Mm. Yeah. And then when you… Um, I don't remember When this. we did our mic test, he had such a very like… Oh yeah. Soothing, oh calm voice. You guys like, should have heard wow. that. Can you do it again? I know. say Oh, it's not the same. It's not the same. Yeah, it's not the same. It's not the same, yeah. I could try, but yeah. Mm. Anyway. Well, how do you get when you get super excited? Does your voice go up? Or is it just like, ah? Oh. <laughs> I, it, <laughs> it goes up, but similar to what you just did. Really? Uh, yeah. Like, but, like, you just got the car of your dreams. How do you react? Oh, I mean, yeah, I could, I can scream and like, I could be excited, but I don't know. Like, I haven't. Do you like jump there. up and down with joy? Oh, I don't do that much. Okay. Like, I don't, I don't, do I don't fluctuate that, that much. <laughs> do you? <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. I mean, it looks like, I mean, he's going to be, he feels like he's a very really calm person. He's a yeah. robot. Yeah. He's yeah. a robot. Yeah. yeah he's whatever a happens, like, whatever. Yeah. You know, that's what yeah, I think. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's what his so kind of personality is. Yeah. But, yeah. Like, you guys, I mean, very expressive. Yeah. Very expressive. Mm-hmm. Very you expressive. jump yeah. up and down if you get the car of your dream. Well, I when I'm watching so sports, I watch a lot of sports. Uh-huh. So when my favorite team, like, scores, I get crazy. I go, oh. like, yeah. Oh, like, okay. Do you ever do that? No, I don't do that. Wow. Do you just go, cool? Wow. Dang. Good job. Yeah. I mean, even if like national team goes, you know, I'm like… Really? Yeah, I'm like… I'm, I never go like… What? Sorry. Oh, okay. I did this. <laughs> you do that though? <laughs> yeah, I do go. Okay. Wow. So they, they programmed that part of you? Yeah, like, yeah. I like just, that. just for sports, I think. Very, very nice. Just for yeah. sports? Cool. No, because yeah, even when you get… When, yeah, even when he gets like turkey while playing bowling… Mm-hmm. I would be so proud. Or yeah. I'd be like, oh my god, yeah, look at me. He's just like… Oh, that's just self-confidence. Yeah. Right there. Just, He's no. just so he bowls like every calm. other day. <laughs> Nonchalant. Yeah. Yeah, it's just the turkey. What's your hobby? <laughs> what, what, like, what do you like to do? Oh, what I like to do? Yeah. I don't know. I don't do you're much. Homebody? No. Yeah, I just stay home, do uh-huh. music. I try to research things that I want to know. Mm. Um, just watch streaming services. You're oh. extroverted. He's introverted. You're an e? <laughs> I'm. I'm. Oh, no, it says ENTP. Yeah, but why are you an E? It depends. Yeah, on I was that. like thinking. It depends on the life that I usually pursue. Like, let's say, you know, when I go, I have to perform a lot. When mm. I like talk to you guys, yeah. like, when I ever have to like, you know, um, talk with people or mm. communicate, then, and that happens for a while. Then when I test it, it usually becomes an E. But oh. it's actually like fifty fifty. Ah, oh, really? It just happens to be. I would say yeah. his like real personality is probably I. Very I. Yeah. yeah. And like work. Or kind of made me a little that way. Mm -hmm. Do you feel more energy being surrounded by people? Or do you feel more recharged being alone? I really like being alone. That mm. feels more more charging. But <laughs> yeah. okay, you're well, not. You're not. <laughs> but I started singing since like what when I was five. So right. I think it's all kind of mixed up. Now. Yeah, oh. you like the audience watching you sing and you know reacting to that too. Yeah, as yeah, well. Like, so that's yeah. a that's a E as well. Yeah, I think. yeah. so that's half. I think. Okay. Depends. Nice. Mm. Since you're here today, we'll say you're an E. Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah, we're all E. Okay. We're all E's. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's rare. Okay. Why? No. Why are you laughing? Nothing. Oh, guys, by Thank the you. way, I have Invisalign and that's why I have a lisp. Just letting we you know. We never noticed. Really? Until you said mm-hmm. it. That's yeah. good. <gasps> Shout out to Invisalign. They're doing their thing. Woohoo! I had no oh. idea. Did you Did you notice? I just thought her teeth… Something about her teeth like… Was shining? <laughs> it looked, no, it looked like coated. Oh, yeah. Because I have them on right now. Yeah. Okay, I want to know about how Isaac like makes friends. Like, do you have a special tip on breaking the ice, getting to know someone? Mm. How do you start a conversation? Uh, I don't know. Usually, you just go and talk. Whatever. Yeah. Okay, yeah, so I, whatever just comes like, to your mind. So this though. is the thing. Yeah. I feel like about Isaac, it's like he's one of those people where like he just stays put and people mm-hmm. are more attracted to him. Mm-hmm. So it's more easier. People like me, it's more like I got to like, hey, what's up? Right? I'm Juni. Hey, what's up? You know what I mean? <laughs> but then <laughs> Isaac's more like… People will probably be like… I kind of want to know more about him because he's so demure. <laughs> Stop saying demure! <laughs> hey, I, have a, I have a question. Do you guys, f- like, when you guys yeah. try to approach like a new person… Do you guys like plan for it? Or do you guys think what to say with them? Like not to talk well, about Well, no. Like a complete stranger? Yeah, or like complete some- strangers. Like when you're, you're sitting there. But there's a moment where like there's only two of you. Like, yeah. And you feel like talking, you know? Yeah, if I feel like talking, if I want to get to know this person, I'm probably the first one to say something. For, um, yeah. I mean, actually, I, I actually, that happens to me a lot too. Like, oh, I usually okay. go and talk. Oh. Like, I mean, it's half and half, but usually right, when right, there's right. like smaller population, I just go and. Mm. Like in Korea? Yeah, that's really? what happened a lot for me too. Yeah, so yeah. We, when he's in his e mood, <laughs> yeah. go talk to them. Yeah, yeah. and then yeah. I go home, I'm like, you know. And then he yeah. charges. Whoa, Dude, I, I can't imagine him speaking Korean. Like like communicating in Korean because his, his English is so good. Oh. Yes. Yeah. Nice. Nice You're compliment. more comfortable in Korean though, right? Yeah, of course. Way more comfortable. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's crazy. I feel Lucky. like in Korea, there aren't that many instances where I have to talk to strangers because it's not a thing here, right? You don't really oh. greet someone. Yeah, like, you know, you true. don't say hello. After hello. you mentioned it, I think I can kind of hear it. Damn it. Sure well, that kind of goes away if you get a dog. When you're walking um, your dog and then you meet other, you know, like dog owners, mm. they 
tend to talk more. Yeah, that's a yeah. great way. Yeah, actually. No, I, thought, I forgot what I was gonna say because you wait, interrupted. Wait, oh, sorry. My bad. No, he was talking about the lisp, and you were talking about the dog. What was I saying oh, before yes, you mentioned the lisp? <laughs> Something about you can't imagine something in Korea because of something. Yeah, you weren't even listening because you no, were focused you were on my list. No, because it's harder to you know approach people in Korea because it's <laughs> not like that here. The culturally, yeah, people don't talk. Yeah, and I was trying to get to a point, but now I don't remember. Well, so let's say okay. like uh, no, as she walks by and he starts talking to you. Do you That's, guys like? Mm-hmm. <laughs> 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 well, like in the elevator yesterday, I was in the elevator and yeah. this guy was like. Started, he, he just asked me like random questions. Is right. the like the elevator was pretty hot? Like the air air conditioning uh, wasn't on. Yeah. So it's like, is the AC on? I'm like, I don't think so. Like, and you start just talking oh, really yeah, naturally. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh wow! Like, hmm. I've gotten in, myself into one of those a lot in the cabs, like taxis. Oh yeah, oh, taxi yeah. drivers yeah. talk. Yeah, taxi drivers talk a lot. I don't want to like cut him. Like I don't want to be an asshole, so I just continuously answer his questions. <laughs> He's yeah. a nice guy. Yeah, yeah. that's nice. Yeah. It's like yeah. But it gets time. hard sometimes. It just gets… Tough. I don't know about Kyo Oppa, but he's a nice guy. <laughs> <laughs> Do you not talk to them? Who? Like if you… If they ask you… Like you know, I'll talk to you. I don't take the taxi. Oh, like P2B Aniyo. You know? I don't take the taxi. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Alright. Yeah. Robot. And then you, you know, fly, they, they, they have like the option of like the… Please be quiet. <laughs> oh wow, you only take good taxis. Really? Yeah, oh, that's the difference taxi. between they have regular those options. Taxi the good ones have, have that. The um one of the one like of the premium IM. ones, yeah, yeah like the big ones. van ones. Yeah, Ooh, it says I want to go fancy. alone. Fancy Damn. boy, big I just like it because it comes in a freaking like exactly yeah. big spender. Yeah. It's not that much more. <laughs> yeah, it's not. It's not much. More. I'm usually like <laughs> if I'm if I take a taxi, I'm usually talking to someone or something anyway. Mm. Oh. On the way. Yeah. But if they do ask, I like I wouldn't mind having a conversation with them. Okay. <laughs> I I've, I think quiet. I've just become yeah, such a <laughs> shit child. <laughs> <laughs> I think I just become so like vigilant over the years when someone talks to me. I'm immediately like, oh. like who if a stranger like talks to me on the street, I'm like, whoa, <gasps> the f- what? Wow, <laughs> why are you talking to me? Um, but you that know, if a- they <laughs> seem nice, then I'll yeah. be like, oh, they, you know. But I don't know. Like I don't. I'm always in a rush, so. Kind of like, oh, wow. nah, 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 nah. Uh, oh I need to rush? get going. Cause she's late. Cause I'm busy. She's always late. I'm okay. a busy bee. Um, busy bee. But in America, it's like a little easier because it's a natural concept for them, like talking to strangers. But small talk is hard. Mm. I've I've become worse at small talk. I don't know what to talk about. I mean, I feel like it's awkward small talk. Mm. Because it's like, yeah, like the first few like questions, I feel like it's similar for like everyone mm. Mm. for small talk. And then after those questions are gone, it's just like… Mm. I mean, there are, I think there are… I think small talks is a gift. Yeah. Right? Yeah. There it's are, like a skill. There, there are a few people who actually are very good very at good it. Very good at it, yeah. yeah without I feel being like awkward. Eric's really good. Eric's very good. Right? Oh, yeah, yeah. I think he majored in like… Small, small talk. Small talk. Small talk, literally, right? That's what it is. What did he major in? Like communications? Yo, yeah, small talk, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I thought. <laughs> Trying to make it sound a little better, but I no. think a lot of people who are in do who do like business are good at small talk. Of course, yeah. yeah. They have to be. Yeah, yeah. David's good at David's small talk. David's amazing too. at small talk. Yeah. No, kind of gets annoying sometimes. No, he just talks but. a lot. <laughs> joking. He's not good at small talk. He just talks a lot. <laughs> he just talks a lot. <laughs> yeah, that, that's like the basis of small talk. Isn't yeah, it? you gotta talk yeah, a lot. You just have to talk a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Throw mm. it out there. That's not small talk. What, that's just <laughs> <laughs> what, like, what was your? What's the difference between like the? I mean, you were in Berkeley, um, so you were in Boston for like a year. Mm-hmm. But did your personality like change there compared to living in Korea and like, when you're speaking Korean? You know, it it needed a time to. Uh, what do you call it? Like adjust, unite. <laughs> oh. So when you speak English, you go, you become more outgoing right. yeah. naturally because mm-hmm. of the the language itself. You yeah, know, it's more expressive than that. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. when you speak Korean, you become you know inverted naturally. Wow. So you have both. So even Koreans, they feel that way. Yeah, of it's course. very interesting. So like even here, like sitting here speaking English, it's much more uh, comfortable in a way. Right. Because I don't, I don't feel like I have to like go over. I mean, try to be more expressive in mm-hmm. certain ways. But like when you start speaking Korean, you kind of do to it, wow. like to say things. But yeah, yeah. And I also feel like there's a whole like like the culture thing too. You know, like the yay, yeah, like yay, like like the whole honorifics and stuff like that too. Mm, yeah, since yeah. there isn't stuff like that in English, yeah, so it's a lot more comfortable. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is more could, casual. Yeah, yeah, way more sure. casual. But then you got to… If you're speaking Korean, I feel like the whole like… The honorifics and then like the… Yay, nunchi, like all that kicks in. Yeah, I mean it's harder to talk to elders. Like mm. older people. It's yeah. much more harder. I don't know why. Yeah. But it's yeah. easier to have small talk in English that way. In that sense. But, but like for me, as I just stay in Korea more, like it feels like English… The attitude towards just life and the language, it's, it gets all blended up right. mm. naturally. So mm. I mean before like… I guess when I was in 20s or even my… Te- teen was really like different. But in my 20s, it was still a little different. Mm-hmm. The way I speak in English and mm-hmm. Korean. So I guess… Do you do you guys ever like get your voices like a bit higher pitch when you speak to elders? When I have to speak in Korean to elders, yeah, in it Korean. gets higher. It gets yeah. higher. Does it happen to you? Because you're such a deep voice, so you probably go like mid, like a normal voice tone. Oh no, you, it, it it gets a little polite. Yeah, it doesn't get that aggressive though. Like, uh, I think it gets a softer. Way, oh, right? softer. Yeah. Yeah. I think I get softer too. Yeah. yeah, you get like very soft. Yeah, but Korean language is soft though. Like, yeah. English is really like. What? I thought it was the opposite. No, the I don't know how technical I'm getting, yeah, but like, like the vocal cords, uh, like uh, the oh, way the, the uh, English yeah. you have to, it gets more the bachar, what do you ah. call it? It's uh, rougher. Wow. Never thought of it that way. It has more friction. <clears throat> like Korean language has less friction. So like what? Koreans have less uh, strength in vocal cords. Oh. Yeah. Why? Yeah. No, so, 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 so the, the language itself is like more stiff. Yeah. But then he's talking about like the the way you use vowels or uh, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. It's, it's much more softer. So I it's softer, but then the it's like it's because of the patim and stuff that it sounds more like cut kind of like. That's why yeah. when you sing in Korean and you sing in English, it's different. I feel that's how I feel. It's when very I sing. hard. Yeah, very different. It's like, very different. Korean has like you have to do really well in consonants. Yeah. But like when you are singing English, you don't really have to think about that. Yeah. yeah I can't do I can't do oo bottom like oo because you don't say oo a lot in English. Like there are not ooh. a lot of words with like oo syllables <laughs> ooh, except oo. So hard. like ooh. when I ha- ooh, when I came yeah. to Korea, cool. we had to record a song called Anulle. I had I kept going anelle anelle I can't it was ulgo shipjana I kept ulgo shipjana they were like ur 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 and I was like ur <laughs> it's so hard like ur ur I mean yeah Korean language isn't really like you know it's a good for singing pop songs like yeah. the modern ones so hmm. Hmm. do you have a lot of friends like are you the type to have <laughs> A few. <laughs> are you the type to have a few close friends or like a lot of? <laughs> I think it's becoming smaller. Oh, okay, because with age, right? Yeah, with age, mm-hmm. it's yeah, like definitely. a natural thing. Yeah, yeah it's, mm-hmm. it's becoming smaller. Yeah. What What are like some conditions for you for someone to become a true friend? Uh I don't know. Like, it depends though. Like, if the vibe, <laughs> the vibe, <laughs> the mirror vibes. I don't the know. Mirror. <laughs> Does he have the mirror? Does she have the mirror? It's my first time actually pronouncing that yeah. thing. Like, really? I've been hearing it so yeah. much, but like, I don't even fucking know. The mirror, the mirror, the mirror, the mirror. I was in here for it. He was here for it. So he's saying, okay, yeah. I'm lost right now. Yeah. <laughs> I still don't know <laughs> exactly. <laughs> uh, I mean recently it's more about um job I guess. Like oh. if I it's uh I get closer with the friends with the closer industry. Right. Mm-hmm. Oh, within the, the same industry. thing. With industry because when you mm-hmm. get older I the friends from college are there they have their own life. They have true. their own they have true. like they're married have kids and everything but I live a totally different life mm-hmm. and there isn't much to talk about later on. Exactly. Later. Yeah. And it's really hard to whenever I express like things that I have stress as well, like they don't really get it, you know. Mm. It's really different. Right, so, right, right, right. Yeah. So it it does it's getting it gets really smaller and then yeah, it's hard to find yeah. friends now. And then you just end up alone. Yeah. Home, sad. Recharging. Home. Recharging. <laughs> That's why you get a dog, bro. <laughs> That's why you get a dog. I'm not as sad as that. Like okay. sad as you though. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's why I have a dog. I just, I'm, I'm not as big as a loser <laughs> as you. <laughs> oh my god. I still have friends. Yeah, I actually oh, have so some friends. I, don't know, I got no friends. So. Yeah, Wait, I do you live alone? Yeah, I live alone. Oh, okay. I was going to them big. I'm oh. trying to. Make no, I love it, bro. Right. <laughs> Very demure. Yeah. Is that what it is? No, I'm, stop just, I'm just I'm just slapping on everything I can. We sound so annoying right now. Stop. That was that was fucking demure. A lot of friends get really close when they realize they like 
they dislike the same thing. So like uh, more than liking uh-huh. some Talk together, shit. yes, so hating talk something shit. together actually mm. brings you closer. And yeah. I think that's so true because you know girls bond by talking shit. About other girls. <laughs> they're like, I don't… At first they don't want to say it. They're kind of careful. Especially if you're not best friends yet. They're like, oh Rebecca, like are you close? And they'll be like, yeah we're kind of close. And they're like, oh I see. Rebecca, yeah. She's cool. The hen has to keep doing and that. And they'll be like, yeah, <laughs> then, she's cool, but you know. And then they'll be like, you know. Uh, green light, green light, green say, light. Oh, you <laughs> green too? Light. And then it just blows. Oh, God. And then, you know, you bond. Wow. It's the best thing ever. That's so, terrifying. What do you, what, what do you, what do you have against Rebecca? I wouldn't want to be part of that. <laughs> sorry, sorry to Rebecca's out no. there. I don't have anything against the Rebecca. Mm. But it's the first name that came to my mind. But mm. Do guys do that? No, we don't talk to you. I think we… Praise more? No? Shut up. Oh what? please. I think praise I made, what? I made friends by praising like a favorite soccer team. Or like a soccer player. Well, I feel like hobbies. For guys it's or like a hobbies. Musician. If you have similar hobbies. Yeah. Or like like sports included. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like Or like in maybe. music too. Like if you have an artist. You don't talk about Actually, the artist and know. make friends. Oh, I mean, you, you do you like this You guys gossip too. It depends on situations, right? Oh, okay. Like I get clo- the closest, the fastest way is to have a common enemy. What? Like, oh, really? Say, mm. Usually, that's why I don't have friends. Yeah, maybe. Like, that's let's, why say, let's say, let's say, <laughs> let's say you have a boss that you really hate on. You know? Uh huh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That usually, if that happens, usually the core workers probably hate him also. True. Yeah. So, and that's like and the best they... way to just bond, mm-hmm. right? That's true. And mm-hmm. having get together and take over the company. Well, that could work. <laughs> but anyway, that could work. but having like same soccer teams or basketball teams or setting—I mm-hmm. mean, for guys like having a sport yeah. thing—that's that's one system. of the ways. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. Like, I don't. Know. Yeah. For me, as long as they don't give off any weird vibes, I'm just like, yeah. <laughs> I so. used to do that, <laughs> but there ended up they ended up being so many weird people. So now <laughs> I do yeah. what Lee Sang Soon told Iori to do, which is when you meet someone, just automatically assume they're not a good person, oh. and then slowly when they show that like they are, are a good person, n- they are a good person, then oh. you trust them. But instead of trusting them from the way beginning and then getting disappointed each time, just have no expectations so oh, you yeah. don't set yourself up for disappointment. Because before I used to be so trusting and so open, and then I would just get hurt. So yeah. now mm. I'm just like. Oh yeah, I don't trust anyone. Yeah. So you don't, are you the type to give a lot of chung right away? What is chung like? What do you mean? Uh, I don't think there's a your word heart. for chung in English. Is it like right? your, your heart? Fond. Like, con- yeah. yeah, bond connection. But yeah. like open up. Do you open up? Do you open up People easily? Maybe it depends. I actually trust in my first impressions a lot. Right. Mm. I mean, I could. That's another like wise way to like me friends like just having no expectations, but you know. You get you become a konde when you get older, right? Uh-huh. Like and naturally, when you meet someone, you have that first impression, mm. and and usually yeah. it becomes like you know kind of right, you know the mm. way you feel yeah. about them at the first time. So you yeah. don't you try not to trust them, but you know and naturally it becomes mm. that. Yeah, factual I'd say somewhere. first imp- impressions are like ninety percent of the time, right? Mm. Yeah, yeah. I think so, the older we get, we have less capacity for bullshit, and we can kind of sense it more. Huh. So if we see that this person is full of bullshit. We're just like, okay, immediately, no. Yeah. Whereas when we were younger, we were kind of like… Let's give them benefit yeah. of the doubt. And like, <laughs> see, if see it out a little bit. Maybe they're just having a bad day. The Koreans yeah. have the, the kwanzang, <laughs> kwanzang thing. Ah. So they look at the kwanzang and they're like… Oh, if the, some people are like very superstitious that way. But Do I feel like that's all a part of first impression kind of. Like the kwanzang I guess, is yeah. included that's kind true. of. No. But I don't, I don't trust kwanzang there a lot no. though. Like I don't get it. You don't get it? Yeah. Like, I don't get how like people could actually figure out what the way their face yeah. is. Yeah. Mm. I learned it in Korea. It's like… Yeah. In but, Korea, they say like… Kwansang is kwa Yeah. It's yeah. like yeah. science. Like… It's fact. But… I mean… Eh. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's like historical. It's like a… All people that look like this act this way. And like, or something something like shady about them if they have a certain… Way of looking. I don't know. Mm. I mean, Kwansang and Saju, maybe they're one of those like Kinda things similar, that people yeah. want to, you know, mm. organize the facts and figure out. Yeah, yeah, know, yeah. Future and stuff. Yeah, yeah. We're going to do a quick balance game. Oh. Okay. Mm-hmm. Juni, do you want to read it? 
All right, so the first one is a friend you rarely see but can share your deepest thoughts with, or a friend you see three to four times a week and have uh, and have fun with, but don't discuss the deep topics. Which one? Which one do you want more? Is the question I think. Let's do one, two, three, and then call it out. Okay. Ready? A or one. B? Okay. One. Wait, wait. It's for like um. <sighs> All right, we're gonna do it on one, two, three. Okay. Are you ready, Isaac? All right, I'm ready. Yeah. Okay. One, two, three. A. a. What did you say, Vanille? Both. <laughs> oh my god. Yes, that's why it's a balance game. God damn it. Uh, I'd Just say one. I'd say B. Okay. B really? Okay. Because you don't like getting deep. I mean, yeah, I don't really like deep talks that much either. And then I feel like for like the A kind of friends, you only need like one or two of those. And then, you know, your, all your other friends could just be the B friends. Oh, amazing. Yeah. yeah. So amazing how you can do this. <laughs> and like the older we get, don't we need, don't we not need to see our friends as much as we did when we were younger? Yeah, we don't, right? we don't see them like, a Because you get busy. Yeah, busy. Like you have your own life. And it's so hard to match schedules now. Mm. Like it's so hard to yeah. get together. So it's but like, yeah, but I I get like I can handle loneliness, mm. but then I can't handle boredom. Mm. Uh, That's why like three to four times. Just there is a difference them, though. Yeah, yeah there mm. is. And then so if you can't, let's say you just can't have that, like both. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Good. His Good job, life Isaac. Miserable. Yes. So you have to choose. Like you have no friends that can talk anything deep, or you just have like just one friend like can tell everything but you you meet him like once a year yeah mm, i'd rather have b oh. wow what like i could handle everything yeah. by myself i don't need wow. to be oh that's, wow. that's cool i really envy his personality though mm. yeah i need to have like two or two two three hour rant with my friends getting mm. deep and oh is it always rants I guess. I mean, with my friends too, like really close friends that are in New York, I, I can't talk to them every like every day. So mm. we set up like FaceTime sessions, maybe like oh. once every two weeks. And then we just like update each other and then like get deep. And then I feel so much better after. Wow. It's like therapy You're for good me. Good friends. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Do, you, do you have it's any friends like that? Not recently. Depends though. Like mm. I don't have like certain friends that way, but… Mm. There were friends that I used to have when I when I was in twenties, right. and then I like meet them very randomly, like somehow. Oh wow! So today I just had this like call with a friend, and we started talking about this like really random deep stuff about like yeah, that just happened. I'm wow! Like, okay. It just happens. <laughs> yeah, it just happens. So wow. Mm. Yeah. Do you um? So you said your friend. A lot of your friends are in the industry, so you probably have a lot of musician or like people who are close to music related mm-hmm. friends. Do you guys get super serious as well? Like sometimes. I mean, musician friends. I don't. I don't. We don't really talk about life that much. Yet, so. Really? Because our life is so similar. Oh. Mm. When you start talking about all these like things that are going on, it's very similar. So it's somewhat you don't really need to talk yeah. about it because you kind of get it. Right. Right. And right. So even if you don't do anything, you kind of you know know each other. Right. Hardships mm. True that. So in a way, that's also having close friends. But mm-hmm. yeah, mm. you guys mm. just meet up and you're like. Right? Yeah. <laughs> that happens. That happens. Yeah. Yeah. Let's just go eat some, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay, next, next one. one. A, a friend who gives backhanded compliments, or B, a friend who constantly copies you. Oh my God. Both are backhanded terrible. Backhanded compliments? What's backhanded compliments? I don't want Compliments that, um, that aren't true? Well, no. Uh, it's not like, oh my gosh, your jacket's so nice. Oh, yeah. like, <laughs> it's like in a way it can sound very insulting. Oh, like, like, oh, oh like, where'd you get your jacket? Did very you, like at the at the dollar thrift <laughs> yeah. store or something? Yeah. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Wait, is that just an That's insult? insult. <laughs> <laughs> That's just a straight up diss. Wait, isn't it, isn't it kind of like oh, like where'd you get your jacket? It's very it's uh, like, uh, unique. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, That's backhanded. Oh, backhanded. You're not as dumb as you look, like that. I see. Yeah. Oh. Right? Yeah, that's cute. <laughs> that's like, like, yeah, yeah. Ashley, you just she wanted to say that. Like, I'm like, she straight up holding that in. She like, hates like, you. She you. <laughs> what did you do on a radio show? <laughs> that she was, damn. I don't know. Like, I think she, I'm sorry. I felt like she wanted to say that since radio. She was holding right, that in. We gotta in. choose A or B, okay? One, oh two, God. three. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. <sighs> Backhanded compliments or oh, they're both so or a friend that constantly copies you. Okay, it's not too hard, Pinyo. You got this. Okay. One, two, three. B. B. Oh, really? Oh, God. 
I'm just gonna say A. Really? Really? Yeah, you get more annoyed by people who copy your copy you. Like, what are they copying? Like outfits. They copy like everything your about car. you. Like I, I wear this. I get a style on my eye, and I fucking wear pink. And I cut my hair short. How do you intentionally get a style? I don't know. Let's just say I fucking copied you because I like I worship you or something. A friend like that just yes. copies everything you Dude, do. Oh, okay. Uh, let's say I, I know what. Kind of. I, know, freaky, I have a good man. example. Like let's say uh, you uh, you're like a designer major. Or something okay. right and you start designing stuff like you had like this really great idea mm -hmm. and like friend just copies that right off the bat that's wow. illegal but Please in a little different way in a sneaky yeah, yeah, way yeah, that yeah. people but you you, uh, you, know, you know that it's you know copy, you know oh okay okay yeah but I it's a close friend though it. like i'd probably say backhand compliments is better yeah mm. okay i mean because yeah. he's not gonna be affected he's not by gonna that, be affected so. by it yeah yeah oh, he wouldn't care he's a, yeah I can't handle that. Yeah, like it's crazy. That was not good. You're so good. Okay. Okay, one more. One more. I'll do it. Um, a friend who never reaches out to make plans, or B, a friend who constantly flakes. Oh, easy. Yeah, right? Easy. Oh. oh my god, you don't listen to what she's saying, huh? Uh -huh. He needs to read it. Yeah, he needs to read it. Uh -huh. Okay, ready? Which, one. which one's better? Which one's better? Which one's better? Okay. One, two, three. A. a. Yeah. Oh. For sure. We all agreed. Yeah. Because if they flake on you… Then just don't reach out. <laughs> <laughs> that makes me so mad when I've gotten all ready and then yeah. they're like, Oh, I can't. I can't do today. Yeah. You know? I hate it's like a waste flake. of my time, energy. Mm -mm. Yeah. How I, long before the meetup is forgivable? Like to cancel? Yeah, yeah, to cancel. I think two hours is the What? Is the Why? Oh, it, it takes a long time for you to get ready then. That's why. For me, if we're meeting at 6 p.m. that night, then at least by 9 a.m. Wow. Oh, damn. Dang. So the day, you have to really like… I need to study, know, you know my day. Like, yeah, I need to know what I'm day. doing that okay. day. How about you guys? <laughs> Neil wouldn't care. He'd be like, okay. No, he would. He, he gets bored, so he will get annoyed. Because oh. now he has to make new plans. Oh. He has to find new friends to go I'm hookah and like, bowling with. Oh. There's like… 30 minutes to an hour before. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's amazing. That's just amazing. Enough, enough time for me to make new plans. <laughs> I mean, you have a lot of friends, so that's probably yeah, possible. That makes sense. I don't have a lot of friends, so if someone cancels, like, I'll just be like, okay, I'm going to stay home. I don't but, try to make plans. Yeah. I, it is more annoying. So if I'm at home, then it's like, it could be like 10 minutes before, and mm. I'll be like, ah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But if I'm like outside already, and I'm like, oh, it's like it becomes like kind of iffy. Like, do I go back home? Right, right, like, yeah, yeah. Like, let's say it was like a like scheduled in between like two different mm. right appointments or whatever you call it. Yeah, two calls different it, calls it friend meets appointments. <laughs> uh, two different, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> friend friend appointments. Yeah. <laughs> then it's like, shoot, like it kind of becomes emehe. You know? It kind of yeah. like, do I go home and rest for like? 15 minutes or like yeah. 30 minutes and so then go out or like… Do I just True. chill here by myself? Mm. Like uh, what should I do? Or like… Those kind of flakes, it's kind mm. of annoying. But right. How about Isaac? Honestly, I really don't care. Wow. I can… I was gonna say like 30 minutes after the time though. Wow, even if they're late and yeah. then you're like, what's going on 30 minutes after? Yeah, I don't, really, I don't really care. Like, what that, if, what if they, cool. they called you out to like… Where do you live right now? I live in… Uh, Susa. Susa. Oh, what if they could, what's like opposite of Susa? What if they called you to like Irsan? Oh, Irsan. I really, <laughs> I, I usually drove, don't. You drove like there. an hour, uh -huh. hour 30, and then you arrived, and then they're late, like 30 minutes later, and they're like, oh, sorry, I can't make it. <laughs> that would piss, come on, Isaac, that would piss you off. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. Usually that really don't really happen. Like, yeah, but, yeah, that wouldn't happen. But I like the randomness of it. Like oh. when you even if you have appointments and not like when they when they cut you off or like something just happens and not, like I have nothing to do and that's mm -hmm. like when you you are actually pretty free like uh, because yeah. you don't really know what to do like you can't do anything you know like that I so I really You're just, just like I had a nice drive 
Yeah, yeah. something like that. Or I could just, you know, go to if if I went to Ilsan literally, like then I would just like get a go to good good like cafe or something. You know, just mm. just, <coughs> yeah, go around. Or maybe I could just call a friend who's around. You know, yeah, that's friend. what I would do. I just call. Yeah, like, it depends call though. Like, that's why his nickname is Holy Sak. Yeah, <laughs> he's got that holy, <laughs> holy with that patience, yeah. understanding. <laughs> Dang, how to be like you? How to be more chill? You, laid back. You don't really. Expect from other people. You know? <gasps> That's what, what you I just said. The first impression. Yeah. yeah. I guess I do. <laughs> you still do. Yeah. You can't change your personality quickly. But these are basic manners. You yeah. can't just flake on Don't someone. Don't expect basic manners either. <laughs> I Is that hate the world we've been, we've come to. I hate people who flake on tangan too. It pisses me off. You do a lot of the. Like sometimes when I want to get rid of something, I do mm-hmm. like a uh, uh, tangan, like for really cheap or like buryo uh-huh. danum. They just flake on me, and there's like ten really? other people that want to get it, uh-huh. but then I reserved it for this person, and then right. they would flake. Oh. Ah, that's that awesome. would be so annoying. That is annoying. Yeah. yeah. What do you think is needed to kind of maintain a healthy friendship? Beyond time. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> yes. Well, yes. Actually, it's very ironic, but like being on time. Yeah. yeah that's really please. hard for me to think to do. Like mm. I get a lot of stress just being on time. Oh, yeah. you do? But yeah. You you're kind of late. Because party? I'm so chill and everything. Like oh, about everything that's the what's downside. going on. So for me, I, I have a very lower standards mm. to myself too. So <gasps> that becomes very unhealthy relationship wise, uh, friendship wise, uh, or even like dating wise. Yeah, everything. because it seems like wow. you don't value their time. Whoa. No, it's basically. <laughs> hey, that was backhanding. He's a guest. He's right? a guest. <laughs> you can't look at him like remember, that. Remember, remember, remember that he's a guest. That's fine. So yeah, I mean, I know I try to value it, mm. but it's one of those things that I get a lot of stress with. Mm. Mm. It's just everyone's so different, you know. Mm. Oh, but for me too, I used to be the person that would arrive 15 minutes early, mm. but then I would end up waiting like 40 minutes. <laughs> yeah. Because mm-hmm. they have a thing called Korea time. What? What's Korea is, time? Where if you say you're going to meet at 6, you meet at 6.30. Oh. What? It's like 30 minutes late. I didn't know that was a Korea time. You I thought that was like that? A, yeah, there's you like, show up 30 there's minutes like a, late? You just have weird, just have weird friends, dude. Yeah, yeah. yeah you've I mean, heard I've of it, right? heard like, of Korea it. time. It's like 30 minutes later than what you But say. I heard… I thought Korea was like… Bali, bali. I mean, hurry, 30 hurry. Is괜찮아. There's a thing like that. Like 30 minutes is okay. No, it's oh. not. There's like a thing called like Korea time. So then… Well, Isaac would if I arrive okay. 15 minutes early, I'm waiting for like 45 minutes. So oh then… My right. I end up just going late too. Mm-hmm. So I guess those friends became that way because they had friends like that as well. So you became one of those people too. But I don't go like 30 minutes late. Mm. Yeah. Or even like gifting. I think gifting, like surprise gifts yeah. for friends is also great. Right. Are you a um, gift giver? Not really. Oh. I try to. Not much of like the… Do you, what about like um, like uh, birthdays? Like do you remember your friend's birthdays and stuff? I hope he does. I, you know, usually we have a very good information on our phone. <laughs> yeah. So like… Gotcha. It'll it'll you. Don't, you don't gotcha. have to memorize gotcha. like every That's very short days. That's like true. you guys don't even remember like, you know. like. I, I know, know Peniel's birthday. Whoa. Yeah. When's my birthday actually? Thank you. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> so now we know. We haven't Pet. spent enough years together, right. Shuni. Yeah. Do you know my birthday? No. That's what I thought. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so like do you guys, when you give presents, do you guys plan out for it? Uh, we used to do this thing like in yeah, our group chat. Yeah. We would all pitch in money and buy one Whoa. nice gift. You guys are nice, man. Yeah. But then it kind of became like too mandatory. Like… Oh. Right? Yeah. So… I mean, it felt kind of mandatory from yeah. the beginning. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then before it was like, we think of what we wanted, what what we wanted to buy uh-huh. our friend. But then it kind of became the friend saying, I want this for my birthday oh, this year. So, one of those. Yeah, so we kind of like it fizzled out and now we That's just get good. individual gifts for each other. But I love it when friends travel somewhere and they buy me like, you know, even it's like a little token or like a keychain mm. because they thought of me. I think that's really sweet. <laughs> And it makes me know, feel loved. Okay. Yeah. And then always we'll like, if, if something, if they reached a milestone if, or if they're celebrating something, I want to treat them out to like a nice meal with some oh. like wine and drinks. Do you guys give like a <laughs> big gift? So like small ones? Like you say wine drinks or like… That's a big gift, but… Wine's a big gift. Yeah. She, got, she got me a very awesome gift for my birthday. Yeah. If we become friends, I'll get you… <laughs> 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 yeah. 
All right. Yeah. Small We've become presents. friends. <laughs> small presents. Mm. Yeah. yeah, small, small presents. presents. It's like, it's not about the worth. It's not about how much it is. It's about… The thought you know, behind the it. The thought behind the thought it. Behind so. That's true. Yeah. Mm. It's like… And if it's like something related to our inside joke or something, that's even better. Oh, right. 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 Yeah. 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 Um, yeah, yeah. yeah, I mean, gifts yeah. are related to our sponsor today because Lotte Food, Lotte mm-hmm. Well Food well says food. Mm-hmm. Pepero is a wonderful snack to express our love. Uh-huh. You know, mm-hmm. we have a Pepero Day for a reason. Mm-hmm. Right. And Pepero Day actually originated in a region here in Korea where female students exchange these stick shaped snacks, so many S words, stick shaped snacks to show their love and care for each other. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but usually Pepero days are for couples, isn't it? Not these too. days, these days now, yeah. It could be for oh, anybody. Was it for friends as well? Back it, in the day? It originated from… Just being friends, from, right? Yeah, with friends and then… Yeah. yeah. These days it's more of a couples thing though. Mm-hmm. I would say. Yeah. If you go… Pepero day is November 11th by the way. Because you yeah, know 11, the sticks 11. look mm. like ones. Pepero. Mm. But something about Pepero is like more… It's like giftable than just like a… Bag of chips. You know what I mean? It's like something about it. Like the packaging. Yeah. And yeah. yeah. That's good marketing by the good. Yeah. Very good marketing. And then on com- uh, on on special days like Pepero Day at convenience stores, they like wrap it. They oh, have yeah. it pre-wrapped. Yeah, like so like it's so nice to buy. Pepero like gift basket. Yeah. yeah that's crazy. That's so like cool. Yeah. So you sh- thank you. You're welcome. Just like this. That's how you Share make friends. your love with your friends with Pepero today. Here you go. Oh, so you're giving <laughs> you're just, uh, throwing away <laughs> gift? <laughs> right. That's so Damn. mean. That's yeah, like real <laughs> real time tangan <laughs> happening yeah, right now. Muriyo nanum right away. Yeah. Okay. Muriyo nanum, your muriyo nanum. Yeah. My muriyo nanum too. Thank you. Yeah. Yay. And I will actually eat it. <laughs> I actually like the pepero day though. Yeah. Yeah. I know it's very commercial and marketing mm-hmm. stuff, but also like ah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he almost ate it too. And yeah. then he got like… <laughs> yeah. He was like… Oh, what am I doing? <laughs> oh, can I, have, can I have one? Thank you. You don't want one? No. You don't a little wanna, later. You don't a little later. Isaac, just the tip off with your teeth. <laughs> I'm joking. You don't want to suck just the, the tip off with your teeth? <laughs> what were you saying? No, it's a, it's a day you could actually give small gifts. Yeah, yeah. it's like… You don't have to prepare anything. You just got to… Buy this. You don't mm. have to buy like a fancy pepper or anything. Yeah. Just yeah. buy a small box yeah. and give it to them. And, and people yeah. really like it, you know. And don't make them yourself. Like <laughs> I've tried. Yeah. It's like I've I've gotten gifts like that and just oh, like yeah, the yeah, personally made one. Yeah. And DIY. It's like, yeah. I'd rather just get the pepperos. It tastes much better. Yeah. Guys, if you guys are from the States, if the nude pepero comes in, those are the best. Oh, those are the best. Those are the best. You don't have to lick the chocolate off. Mm. It's already licked for you. Which one do you like the best though out of these three? Almond. Almond? Uh, yeah. Should we try the almond? The almond is so good. This is my first time trying the white cookie. It's really? good, right? How is it? Mm. They're always like… Nothing they're more? slamming. No, I want to try the red one. They're slamming. Like, the, the, the original… One? Yeah, I like the, the original. original is actually like the Classic. go-to. Classic. Classic. Yeah. Original. Okay. Okay. We're playing games so now. I'll be playing this. So for pepero game, we all have five five pepitos, mm-hmm. and we take turns stating "Never have I ever" questions. And if you have done the questions, you eat one pepero. Mm. So the first person to finish all five pepero loses. Got all it. Right. Okay. So, wait, never have I. Do- never have I ever. No, this is extra. <laughs> so you do. So you say something that you've, you've done yourself but you no. feel like other people have it. Never have I ever. So something you haven't done but you think other people would have done. Ah, got it. Never have I ever uh, smelt the air of the year 93. What the? <laughs> Go and take a f***ing bite! <laughs> you oldies! Now they're gonna all target me. Yeah. Yep. Ashley? What are you doing? Oh. He's sucking the tip off. Okay, I was like, <laughs> never have I ever brought a dog to dive studio. Oh my god. Mm. Oh, we're just oh. targeting him. Okay. He targeted all three of us with age. Okay. <laughs> never have I ever had a pet. Oh. God. Oh. oh. You had a pet. I've had a pet. We all had a pet. pet. <laughs> 
Nice. Good job, Isaac. I'm sorry. Never have I ever been to Canada. Oh my god. <laughs> I've never been to Canada. No, you guys yeah, are you lying. You don't eat it. Oh yeah, I've been to I haven't been to Canada. Never Not yet. You've never been? You swear? I've never no. Been. I want to go. I tried, but thankfully I didn't. Say. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was just for today. <laughs> <laughs> never have I ever worn glasses to dive studios. <laughs> You've actually never worn glasses. Yeah, and I wear glasses too. What? Yeah. Really? Loser. Girl. No. Never worn them to. Did you never wear glasses? No, I never wear glasses to dive. Not even fashion glasses. No, never. Wait, I have two left. Okay. How many do you have I left? I have uh, two left. What? Can you only has one left? <gasps> yeah. Okay. Dude, someone go for. Come on. Wait, what does the winner get? Nothing. Nothing. No <laughs> 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 okay, Neil, go. Never have I ever been to Papua New Guinea. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, need, you need a reminder of where that was too. <laughs> Who's next? Me. Oh, oh yeah, him. He's the guest. No, 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 no. This is fun. Go on. Go on. Uh, I'm saying target him. Yeah, 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 Never yeah. have I ever not been on a praise team. Not been on a praise yeah. team? Yeah. been on a praise team? Yeah. So you have been on a praise team? I have been no. on a praise team. Yeah. You have been? You just, <laughs> I have been too. So anyone oh who I have been hasn't too. been on a praise team, eat it. Oh, okay. okay. You've been? Mm. What'd you play? Guitar. Nice. Mm. It's either Peniel or Juni. No, it could be you. <coughs> no, she has two. Oh, is that? She has two. I have two. Oh, yeah, she has two of them. Okay, 문장이 안 만들어지. Never have I ever came to dive studios with a piercing on. Oh. You don't have any piercing on? I don't have one. Kill this is an earring. <laughs> oh, but on the left one. It's, they're both earrings. earrings. You lost? Yeah. I'm dead. He's okay. dead too. No, it's earrings. What the hell does that mean? It's that's different. A, that's a piercing. Are you talking about like the Korean, like the piercing or like if you have a, earrings and just, if you just have, have a hole? If you have a hole, that's a piercing. Well, I mean, I hope you got a hole in your ear. I do, but I never. <laughs> Yay, we won. Um, you guys lost. <laughs>
You can take what some. The heck? <laughs> you can What's wrong with you? Pre take some so you don't have to go and buy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah let's keep it. Oh, yeah, let's keep shout it out to Pepper. Yeah, yeah, yeah shout out to Lotte yeah. Well Food for Lotte sponsoring well food, thank this you. year's Pepper Day. Pepper baby. If you want to watch the video version of this episode for free, please check out youtube.com slash dive pods and make sure to follow and review our podcast. Five stars only. And thank you, Isaac. Good luck with everything. And thank we you, hope Isaac. to see you again. Thank you. Thank you for inviting me. It was really and fun. Thank, thank you, you, listeners, for thank listening. You listeners. Thank you. It was Bye. a nice, chill, but fun episode. And then what do you say? Mm. Show your love with Pepe! Pepe! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> If you enjoyed this episode, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and check out the other videos. Woo-hoo! Season 4, baby! Yeah. We're back! We're back! Back! back. back. back.